did. I, your lips kind of came close. Yeah, I missed. A bit of a fail there. Does that count? Does that count? I does that count. count as a penis? I, I think it you does. Were, I think you were teasing me. Yeah, I think so too. Um, public displays of affection. That is this week's topic. Yep. Oh, wait. No. No? It's Catterday! 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 Catterday. Now think, this week's Who topic is phoning is me? Someone's phoning me. Okay. I'll tell you. This week's topic is public displays of affection. So we're in public, and we are going to display our affection. Um, we're in the park. We're in the park. Mars eating soup. So good. Soup in the park. Anyway, like we said, this week's topic is public displays of affection. What do you think of public displays of affection, Mara? <laughs> I think all in moderation. <laughs> to be fair, other people's public displays of affection aren't too bad, but sometimes it is too much. I think it's yucky. I have this terrible bias, and I don't know where it comes from because it's certainly not intentional. But if it's like, if it's a queer couple, then I'm it's all totally over that. okay. It's okay. But if it's a, if it's a heterosexual couple, I'm like, ew! Why are they doing that in public where everyone can see them? Mm-hmm. And it's just this horrible double standard. I don't know. No, I get that. I, I guess exactly. I'm sure. It's because I'm gay. No, I have the exact same thing. We're bad people. Sometimes she tries bad to... Bad people! Sometimes she tries to kiss me, and I have to turn my head away. <laughs> In public. I've just gotten so used to kissing her all the time that I can't really tell if it's different than her in public or not, so... I don't know. It gets pretty bad. I apologize. What else is there to say? Um, I don't know. I mean, oh, what constitutes as a public display of affection? Or PDA, for those who do not know the acronym. The more you know. (laughs) (laughs) Anyway, um, I would say anything the more that yeah, anything. I feel like if I hug you like this, it's a bit much. Yeah. Maybe. I'm okay with holding hands mm-hmm. and saying things like I love you. Yeah. That's fine. But see, I think the issue with it is that it's not that it's like, ew, kissing is gross, but no, like you're you're seeing this person's intimate life and it's kind of weird. And sadly, I think one of the unavoidable topics of the queer community is that if you're if you're taking part in a public display of affection with a member of the same sex or gender, sometimes that itself elicits some bad reactions. Yeah, there was this one time we were at a bus stop, and Mara and I, we, we, I don't think we were even holding hands. Mm-hmm. We were standing like No, that. we weren't. We were definitely. We were like this far apart. No. We might have been holding hands, but we were kind of just like making faces, lovey faces at each other. I love it so much. So much. So we weren't much. kissing or anything. This was before I would unintentionally kiss Mara in public. She can't humble herself. I can't. I have no self-control. When she got the piercings, oh my god. She's not supposed to kiss me. Oh my god. <laughs> I just smacked me, push me off of her. So I just had no idea what I was doing. But anyway, so we're at the bus stop. Yeah. We were maybe holding hands, I don't know. But we were at least a foot apart. Yeah. And um, we were just making lovey eyes at each other. Kind of yucky. Yeah. But Pretty gross. we heard this banging on the glass in the bus shelter behind us. And, of course, we didn't think of any. I didn't think it was for us or anything, because why would it be? But then it goes again, so we look, and it's like this old lady. And she looks at us and sucks her lips in. And just shakes her fist and points at God. She was really tiny, and I was horrified. She looked so angry. And I was oh. like, oh, I'm sorry I am looking at my girlfriend in public. <laughs> I wanted to cry. Anne thought it was hilarious. It was so funny. <laughs> it's really not squirrels. Yeah, it is. It's beautiful. Squirrels are stupid. They're gorgeous. They're really cute. Mara has this squirrel in her that has a round tail and a black body and it's like somebody cut up two squirrels and crafted them together like a tree have a good week everybody <laughs>